What's up everybody, I'm Guy Firefly, and today we have a Pokemon Showdown Live, this is going to be NU, and as I mentioned before in my update video, it is going to be a combination of some pretty serious stuff as well as some pretty stupid stuff. So, yes, I'm really excited, I like this team a lot, I've been actually using a lot more than I use most any other team, so it's been working out pretty well. Anyways, let's go ahead and go over the team. First off, we have the main, like, center guy of the team being Focus Punch Kecleon, and this set just works so well. Um, there is a lot of, like, mind games with it because Shadow Sneak, uh, means that if you're up against a normal type, especially ones that are locked in, and they go for a fighting type move, or no, if you're up against either a normal type or a fighting type, and they go for a normal type fighting type move, then you go for Shadow Sneak, and then they're locked into it, and then you go for Sub and Focus Punch, and you kill them, and it's great. <laughs> yeah, that's mainly what this thing does. It has priority and then uh, sub punch and it works so well. Alright, next we have Swanna. The only reason I put Swanna on this team was because I saw it was a B- minus in the viability rankings. And I didn't believe that because one, I never see Swanna. And two, in my experience, Swanna has been kind of garbage. So I just looked up the Smogon recommended set and then I changed the EV slightly. I just have enough to outspeed 95s because there's no reason to run 98 unless I run into like freaking Raticates or something. But I don't think that's going to happen. So yeah. Uh, Life Orb, Scald, Hurricane, Roost, and Defog. Hurricane, because I love missing. Oh boy, is that my favorite. <laughs> Uh, next we have, t uh, this is the normal Flareon set, I'm running Jolly over Adamant because speedy makes speed speed, as well as I'm not entirely sure if Adamant outspeeds, uh, Jolly Pangoro, and Jolly Pangoro is quite an issue. This thing hits really, really hard, and that's always good. Next, we have Regirock because Regirock is the king of defensive mons, he is like nine times more bulky than anything else in the tier, that's such a not at all okay defensive stat, um, so he can pretty much take any hit, whether it's super Super effective or not, so long as it's on the physical side, and it doesn't even have shabby special defense. Next, we have an Uxie. This is not an, a normal sub calm mind Uxie or uh, lead rocks, U turn, or dual screens with mental or any of those. We have calm mind speedy Uxie with uh, Psy Shock, Giga Drain, Hidden Power Fire, and Calm Mind. Giga Drain for all the rock types in the tier, uh, Hidden Power Fire for steel types and grass types and such, and then Calm Mind because it's Calm Mind and Psy Shock for Stab. And last but not least, we have Specially Defensive Vileplume because I would like something to get rid of status. I realize I have a Toxic Orb player on the team. I don't care. Status is such an issue, especially for Kecleon because Kecleon gets burned a lot since it's so slow, it generally doesn't get up its sub quickly, as well as Uxie. Uxie gets status a lot because people are like, hey, I don't want that to set up on me. Uh, I have a sort of ladder to count. It's I'm in like the 1200, or not 12, yeah. Tw I, I, yeah, 1200s. I don't know why I hesitated so many times there. So we should hopefully be getting some semi-competitive games at least. Alright, so he's either going to lead with this and be the super annoying Endeavor lead set, or he's going to lead with this. I'm going to lead with Kecleon either way. He is going to lead with Archeops. Now, I'm going to go straight for a Focus Punch right here, because he's either going to go for Endeavor or Taunt. Or Stealth Rocks. That works too. Oh, not, obviously not Endeavor. And that means I get get to put him down to his sash and he can't Endeavor anything because I can go for your Shadow Sneak and kill him off, which is fantastic because I really hate that thing. Generally, I take him on with um, Regirock because I'm silly, but I just now realize that I shouldn't be doing that. All right. He's going to go into Rotom Fan. I'm going to switch into... Debating between Flareon and Uxie. Flareon to catch the burn, Uxie to do anything else. I'm gonna go into Uxie because if nothing else, I can just heal off the burn later. He is gonna go for the Wisp, that's fine. Uh, right now, I'm just gonna stay in until he switches out. He's probably gonna switch out into Scyther once he does, but considering I have Regirock, I can take whatever hit. And plus, I'd like to get off a bit of chip damage if nothing else. He is gonna go straight for the Bolt Switch. What is he gonna go into? He could go into Mesprit because Mesprit could take any hit from me easily as well as it generally carries knockoff all right he's gonna go into scyther though um hopefully he's the either bandit or scarf set because i really really don't like um sub sd scyther although sub sd scyther means i don't have to deal with volt turn shenanigans whatever he's gonna go into machoke now okay so i don't have an oh actually i do have an easy check for this i was wrong okay vile plume he's probably gonna go for dynamic punch why did that do so much that's not an okay amount of damage that like like that has to be banded. I'm really just, why do I have, okay, there we go. Um, I forgot, I don't have um, damage calc link, uh, like a, a quick link, so I just go to the site and click damage calc from there because I'm a noob and can't click uh, 
slash calc for whatever reason. Okay, there we go. 252. Let me just put this to bashful so that I can have a neutral nature against a Machoke. Sure, Rest Hawk. Yeah, I, what if this was banded? Choice, banned. Um, yeah, I don't know why that did. Oh, wait, no, that did. That, that, he is choice banded. That's really weird. I'm gonna go straight for the sludge bomb. I actually should have clicked synthesis, but whatever. I break through the confusion anyways. If I got a poison there, that would have been great. Okay, so I don't know why I didn't see it last time, but now we know that he is, in fact, um, leftover, so I don't have to worry about Scarf tricking stuff like that. He's gonna go for the uh, slashy move, probably, so I'm gonna go into Regirock right now. If he wants to go for Will-O-Wisp, I'm actually going to be really, really annoyed. Okay, he does go for the Slashy move. Now, he has an option here. I think I'll kill him even if I'm burned, so I'm not worried about... Actually, actually, you know what? I'm going to set up rocks, because I could kill him right now. Ooh, he missed. That's unfortunate. I've actually gotten good hacks in this game, which is surprising, and that's the only thing that's really ha- uh, no, I guess I could broke through the confusion, and I got the sleepy thing, so I have been getting pretty good hacks, but, uh, I don't feel bad. If you're running Dynamic Punch, then, uh, you deserve to get hacked for one, and then two, I also had a uh, game right before I recorded this where I missed five hurricanes in a row, and or not in a row, but I missed five hurricanes in one game, and every single miss mattered, like had I just hit one, it would have been over, so I'm not just sitting here like, wow, bro, that sucks, because cause, like, it's actually really, really preferable for me. Um, okay, I'm going to switch into Uxie now, because Uxie can side shock this thing and definitely outspeed it, as well as he's... 100% guaranteed to be asleep this turn, as far as I know. Um, unless I missed a turn somewhere, but I don't think I did. I'm gonna go straight for a Psy Shock. He switches in a Mesprit right now. Um, I don't like that. That means he's either got U turn or knockoff. Honestly, I'm just gonna let him kill this because, yeah, okay, now I get switch, in switch initiative, so that's always fantastic. If he goes into Typhlosion, then I'll switch into Kecleon so I can Sucker Punch and get off massive damage, as well as uh, nerf his Eruption a fantastic amount, especially with rocks. He's gonna go into Rotom Fan. That's not prefer. Actually, I have Swan on Swan out speed too, so that, that is preferable. Okay, let me go for a Scald now. Scald easily kills this or does a ton of damage to anything left on his team. I think I'll be able to two hit KO anything left on his team with Swana, um, and I should outspeed everything unless no, I shouldn't outspeed Scyther um, or Typhlosion, but Typhlosion is not going to be switch in right now. I'm going to go straight for the Hurricane here, which is actually a terrible idea. Um, oh. That's not fun. Is he scarfed? I think he's scarfed, which means that I can go into Kecleon and I can go for the Sucker Punch because he will not be able to do anything to me, especially if he's not expecting the Sucker Punch. Okay. Well, what I'm going to do now is I'm going to go for the Shadow Sneak on the off chance that he wakes up right now. Um, he doesn't anyways. Okay, so... Uh, focus punch. Because I can't kill him with another Shadow Snake. Alright, cool. We're gonna kill him off now. That's fantastic. That was actually a really bad situation. So, I know his Scyther is choice in some manner. I'm not actually sure if I can kill him, though. Okay, he goes into Typhlosion anyway, so I'm not worried. I'm gonna go ahead and go for the Sucker Punch. Sucker Punch will easily um, put him at 25-ish range. I'm not sure if he'll be able to switch in again. Most likely not, but he probably will stay in anyways and just sack it. Uh, yeah, okay, he has to stay in now. He goes for Fire Blast, and that is, like, nine different kinds of specs. Um, he's, he's actually wearing, like, nine sets of choice specs. Yes. Um... Tempted to go into Flareon to Flame Charge, but then I want to outspeed Scyther anyways. Actually, I have to do that because Regirock will not be able to take a hit after taking a Fire Blast. So I'm going to go ahead and go for a Flame Charge, and he's going to sack his Typhlosion. Oh wait, no, I forgot. His Mesprit's um, Choice Scarf, so that's not good. These are the times when I wish I had Quick Attack instead of Flame Charge, but whatever. Um, I guess I kind of have to sack Flareon. Oh, and I live. Oh, yes, we live in. What's up now? Get wrecked, Mesprit. And I actually live that really nicely. Okay, so now I win because Typhlosion dies and I don't take poison damage that turn. And he goes into Scyther and I go ahead and I'm going to go for the Flare Blitz and uh, steal this man's life. So that is GG. 
and I will go ahead and find another battle. Hopefully it doesn't take like nine years to find because sometimes it does, especially in NU when you're not at the bottom of or top of the ladder because those are really the only times that you can find battles consistently. Um, if I can't find one quickly enough though, then I will go ahead and pause the battle or not, not battle, pause the video until we find another one. All right, there we go. We found a battle. Um, leads are probably going to be uh, Rock, Bug, uh, Weasel Guy, not a weasel. What are these called? Otters. Otter Guy. Or, um, or, um, Fuzzy Thing. I'm going to go with Swana because Swana can deal with, like, a couple of those. If he wants to just kill me, that's fine. I don't particularly need Swana for this team, especially since he has an electric type. Not that I'm worried about it, because I have Rock, and Rock just, like, takes all of the hits times three. So, yeah. And then I have, uh, I have Vileplume for his Grand Bull, as well as Float Soul, and I actually just Oko him. Uh, one second, I'm going to take a sip of my water. Ah, okay, so let's see what he has left. I think he's gonna switch into either Kangaskhan or Fuzzy Thing And if he switches into either of those then I have a free switch into my Regirock, especially since I have Drain Punch so I can easily um, Win one-on-one -on -one versus a Kangaskhan unless it has like Power Punch and Drain Punch But even then I generally still win one-on-one -on -one. So now I'm gonna go out into Regirock. Hopefully he doesn't go for a Power Punch because that would be a bit of an issue He's just gonna go straight for a Fake Out and that will do actually like like, literally zero, because I got all of my health back with leftovers. I'm gonna go straight for a Drain Punch now. If he wants to switch into Grand Bull, that's fine. That's just gonna give me an opportunity to set up my rocks for free. Not that I particularly need them against this team, especially since the only thing weak to rocks is already dead. But, uh, it's just nice for chip damage. He doesn't actually have any, um, U-turn or Volt- Okay, what? Hang on, I'm gonna just do X- Okay, not that- I did not mean to do that. I hit control 1 instead of shift 1, because I'm good at things. DT, drain punch, because drain punch is the same base power as brick break, but it gives you HP back, so this guy's doing it wrong. Um, he's going to go out into Floatzel now. I can actually take a hit from Floatzel, Floatzel if I cared to. Why are you not banded or life orb? What are you doing? Stop whatever it is that you're doing. I'm going to go into Cacleon now. Um, oh wait, no, I forget. for some reason I assumed this was special because, uh, yeah. Alright, let me go into- I forgot that these things even get bulk up. That's so weird. Alright, let me go out into... I don't know. I'm gonna go out into Vileplume. He's gonna Baton Pass? No, this was his biggest threat because nothing else on his team I'm scared of. Um, Malamar could be an issue, but... Like, not really. I just need to get a little bit of chip off on it. He is going to go out into Malamar. Alright, that was his best switch. But I feel like Floatzel would have been the scariest thing he could have switched into. Whatever. I'm going to go ahead and go for... No, he's going to go for the Psychic move. I'm going to go into Regirock then. Um, unfortunately, I will probably have to sack Regirock from here because this thing obviously carries superpower. Or, you know what? I just have to take one and then I'm going to T-Wave it and then I'll switch out into something else. And then probably sack that. Let's... I, um, hopefully he's choiced in some manner. Although I find it illogical for him to go for a... Um, yeah, okay, he's not. I didn't think he would be. I just really wanted him to be. If he's Lum, that's actually going to be really annoying. Although I'd find it um, a little silly. Because generally these things run rest talk. So r Lum on a uh, Malamar would be a little unnecessary and kind of dumb. Alright, let me go out into... Who do I want to sack? I think probably Flareon. Flareon is not helpful anymore, really. So I'm going to go out into Flareon. Um, since he's already at plus two, this poses a large issue. I think I have to go out into Swana after I sack Flareon. Actually, I live one. That is so surprising. And now I get off my Toxic Orb, which means I can hit him really hard with a Flare Blitz. Um, okay, not really hard, but, like, kinda hard. Um, is he leftovers? He is. Alright, let me see here. Swana usage versus a Malamar. And let's just... Okay, so, if he's that set, then I actually can't even kill him. But I'm gonna go out on a limb and say he's probably not. Uh, I do have to hit a Hurricane, which is 
Really unfortunate. Actually, I even have to hit a hurricane and get max damage. Or not max, but near max. So that's uh, always great. Or I guess Swana could just die after hitting one and then... um. Paralyzed, yes! Oh my god, victory, or not victory, but justice. Paralyze, no! I hate my life. I hate, I hate this game! Why? Fine, you know, whatever. Okay, he's gonna go for the, uh, the punchy move with the thing and the, uh, attack ups. So I'm gonna go for, uh, Shadow Sneak. And then, yep, okay. And now he's going to probably go for the uh, the dark move. So that means I go for the dark move as well and pray that I can live one. Oh, he goes for the psychic move. Ha! Oh, I'm so good at this game. And now he's going to probably go for the psychic move again, unless he's really bad, in which case it's whatever, because I already lost a hack, so I don't feel too bad. And if he doesn't go for the psychic move again... Uh, or no, no, if he does go for the psychic move again, then I can get off sub, and that means that I can, uh, focus punch him and get off a lot of damage. So, we will see. Oh, wait, I outspeed him because of the thing, so it won't matter. Either way, I'm not gonna die, it'll just matter if, um, I will get my sub broken or not. One second, actually, sorry. Okay, there we go. Just in time. I was actually, I'm actually a little bit sick right now, so I didn't want to, like, cough into my mic because, like, that would be bad. So he unfortunately does go for a. Oh, right, I outspeed him. Grrr. Okay, well, I'm. Um, he's gotta go for the punchy move, right? He has to. Like, that's. He has to go for the punchy move. Okay, well, we're not gonna figure it out. Um, that's probably a good thing. <laughs> okay, okay. Now I'm gonna go for sub and really hope that he goes for the punchy move. Por favor, go for the punchy move. Yes, he went. Oh wait, I'm, I'm so dumb. Why do I keep thinking that that's not gonna work? Okay, well I'm gonna go for a shadow snake now, and then oh no, should I sucker punch? I should sucker punch, because because he's probably going to um, go for another one, seeing as I already went for a shadow snake last time that didn't work out. So, ah. Uh. Kecleon not being slower really, really hinders this whole process. Okay, so I'm actually just gonna pause until I either lose this game or, or, um, or, or, yeah, don't lose this game, but that's unlikely. I'll see you guys in a second, because you don't want to see this. This is just needless, um, mind games and unnecessary amount of time because this guy's taken nine years. All right, see you guys in a sec. Okay, so, like, I, oh, gee, I wonder what happened that battle. It's a mystery. I'm gonna leave it up to your imaginations what happened. Um, okay, so Suwana actually completely destroys this team, so that's exciting. Um, if he leads out with anything except for this thing, I'm just gonna scald because I don't want to miss, and I definitely know I outspeed. Okay, and he's gonna, actually he's gonna go for the hurricane, which is really, really, really bad. Um... Okay, I don't know what to do here because I want to kill this, but he could easily switch out. I have to switch, I have to. Um, I'm going to go out into Uxie, because I know I can take a hit. And he is going to switch out into Cradley, alright, cool. I'm going to switch into Vileplume now because if he wants to lock me in, then I can uh, not necessarily beat him, but I can be at a stalemate one. I hate my life! Okay, um... Let me go for a sludge bomb here and hopefully poison something. That is not, that is not actually, okay, I have to sack Swana now. Unfortunately, I would like for Swana to have done more, but no. And I actually need to get my own rocks up, otherwise Vivillion or Vivillant, whatever it's called, is going to totally destroy me. Okay, Kecleon, go do the Kecleon things. Actually, no, I have Kecleon, so not really, but then I'll have to sack something and get it in most likely, so that's a bummer. Ha! Ha ha! I don't feel bad for you. Using Vivalon means that I hate you. Okay, so. Um, Sock probably comes in right now. 
if I had to make some random guess, and I'm gonna go for a Shadow Sneak now. If I end up losing this, that's actually gonna, like, destroy my whole life. Yes! Yes! You see what I- this is what I was talking about. The Kecleon Mind Games. Now he's going to switch out, which means I get a free sub, and if he doesn't, then he's actually a lord among men. He's gonna go into Cradley, and... This is it. This is your time, Kecleon. Focus punch the world. Focus punch the world. Oh, and I live it. Okay, nice. Yes, that means I still have a sub and I can focus punch the world. Okay, um, I actually beat everything one-on-one -on -one except for that sand slash, which means he has to go into it. Um, so that's, that's great. And if he wants to, okay, he got, he does go into sand slash. I will be able to get off at least one focus punch. And unfortunately now he knows my strats. So that means he's probably going to go for, um, knock off next time he goes in the, what? That did zero. Like what? Uh, okay, fine. Let's go into Uxie now because Uxie can go ahead and giga drain this thing. Uh, he's going to go for earthquake because he's silly. Um... I'm, yeah, I'm just gonna go for a Giga Drain. He might expect a knockoff and go into, like, Sock or something, but I doubt it. He is going to knock off on me, which actually hurts him more than it hurts me, because that means that if Sock comes in, it will never be able to beat me, because knockoff will do, like, zero damage. Okay, now he's gonna go into the Bug Guy. I know that that is not the Bug Guy. Um, well, I have a Kecleon. You do not have priority, and I'm definitely gonna take you down pretty low. Um... Now I'm just gonna sack my Flareon, because Flareon doesn't do anything. I apologize if you can hear the bell ringing. For one, there's a school that is right next to me, and two, they're still in school, and I feel bad for them, because I already had my finals this week, so I got out I got out early, so like I'm not on school on a Friday, which is so great, I can't even tell you, but ugh, it's horrible living next to a school. Um, I mean, not really, it doesn't affect me in any way other than like bells ringing at early times in the morning and by early I mean like freaking 1 p.m. and <laughs> that's early to me okay now he's gonna go for the um the uh knockoff so what that is not knockoff well I suppose it's a better choice because I do have sucker punch but whatever um he's just gonna forfeit that means I can actually get in three wins which is fantastic okay so Oh, I don't hate this team. No, no. Oh, I love baton pass. Okay, yeah, yeah. The only kind of baton pass I'm okay with is coil pass because coil pass is definitely beatable. It's not that obnoxious, and if you get swept by it, you're really bad. Like, I have used coil pass since Huntail gets it now, and it's definitely not broken. It's really fun to pass out in a focus punch Kecleon, actually. I have a different team that I guess I'll use if you guys want to see it. But, um, yeah, this doesn't get, no wait, but it does get specs and, like, a million freaking special attacks, so I'm gonna switch out into Uxie. Um, yeah, yeah, that, like, a million, basically. Um, but he can't do anything to Flareon, so as soon as I, I'm just gonna go for an HP Fire. Actually, that does less than Psyshock, but whatever. Uh, now I just go out into Flareon, and I go for a Flame Charge, get up my speed, and then I can, uh, proceed to rip a hole in this team a gigantic okay no oh, i forgot that, that that this guy's a thing um i'm gonna say <laughs> i'm gonna go out on a limb and say that i do not do 89 percent to a sand slash but I'm, i might as well check anyways right if adamant flareon does 89 percent to a sand slash then i might have to change that honestly sand slash um no it doesn't do 89 percent okay I was mainly getting when I said that it, I'm gonna, or uh, that when I was expecting it to do that much, but you know, uh, I can dream, can't I? So he's probably gonna switch out into Lapras now. I'm gonna go ahead and go for a Hurricane, and if he stays in, then he's actually a god, and um, yeah, yes, beautiful, yes, fantastic. Now, based on how much he did, there's no way he scarfed. Uh, because even though I have very little HP investment and no special defense investment, I know for a fact it cannot do that much to an Uxie, um, because Uxie is so bulky. Um, he's gonna go for- this is not a rain team, what are you doing? Is this, um, hydration? That's really bizarre. Okay, he's gonna toxic me, that's unfortunate, but whatever. Uh, now that just means that I can get off a free focus punch on something, and then if he wants to go out into one of his flying guys, which I'd say is unlikely, then I can, uh, just hit it with priority. And that means Lapras is down. Lapras is super annoying. Like, it's not really hard to deal with, 
on most teams, but there are just some teams you build, and then Lapras just walls them completely, because you don't expect to see a Lapras since it's so bad. Okay, he's gonna try and pass out into his Rampardos, like a little obnoxious child that he is. I don't know what to say. That I'm just gonna go into Regirock, and I'm actually just gonna spam, um, oh, never mind. He's not Baton Pass. That's cool. I always expect the worst when I see this thing. Maybe he is. He's just like a combination. I'm just gonna spam Thunder Wave now. Actually, that's what I'm gonna do, um, because if he is Baton Pass, then I don't want him to be able to Baton Pass out a bunch of speed. I'm gonna go into Vileplume now, and especially since there's Rain Up, I'm not worried about I don't like you, I don't like anything you do, I'm gonna go for a rem therapy, uh, oh no, spooky, yeah, now I'm gonna, now I'm gonna go for a sludge bomb, because he's gonna switch out, unless he is, um, in fact, a lord, which is possible, but I'd say it's unlikely, um, he's probably gonna go out and swoobat, actually, but swoobat's so frail that I don't, I do not even slightly care, um, yeah, that, and this is my defensive vile plume. Now, unless he has Psy Shock, he's not going to be able to kill me. And even if he does, then I can uh, just Revenge Kill with Cacleon. There we go. Swoobat's dead, and that's fantastic. Okay, so now I'm assuming Ninjastic is going to come in. He's the bat. If he's banded, then he's a really stupid banded set because he um he's he's running Speed Boost over Infiltrator, and it's like you're a Ninjask. What's going to outspeed you? You have the highest speed in the game, other than I think Deoxys Speed maybe one other thing and and like yeah you do not need that okay so i'm gonna go for a stealth rock because he's gonna switch out probably and then that just means that i get free damage on it whenever it comes back in as well as this thing but i think he's trying to baton pass out into it if i had to guess okay now i think i'm just gonna sack flareon because flareon kind of just gets totally beaten by these two He's gonna spin, that's fine with me, because now I get off a of Flare Blitz on something, and that means that that's gonna do a lot of damage. Um, okay, he's gonna kill me now, that's fine. And that just gives me a free switch in, in a free switch in to Swana, and I'm gonna go ahead and go for a Scald here. Scald should pretty much kill everything left, because Ninjask is too frail to take a hit, this is weak to it, as well as Rampardos is one, too frail to take a hit, and two, weak to water, so... I don't think there's any scenario where he wins here, unless I'm just, like, really silly. Uh, please burn. Please, por favor. Ah, uh, now I have to switch out into Regirock and go through this whole process again. Um, okay, so long as he doesn't have a U-turn, that's fine. Alright, now I'm gonna actually just switch out into Kecleon. Wait, do I want to do that? Does that make any sense? Not really. I would switch out into Swana right now because it's really funny and then like I predict him but I don't actually really have the ability to do that unfortunately now I'm gonna have to sack my Kecleon which is a total bummer but it's um really the only thing I can do to win he has to rapid spin here anyways so it doesn't really matter um and now <laughs> I'm really tempted to just go straight for the focus punch on the off chance he switches or something uh yeah that's fine though now I just go out into Swana, and now I win, because I actually have enough, just enough HP to uh, beat him anyways. He's going to protect, because he's obnoxious. You gain nothing from that protect. You're not going to live. I'm a Swana, and you're not going to... Yeah, whatever. I don't even know what I'm getting at here. Um, actually, if he's Scarfed, then I lose, and that sucks. Um, okay, well, he's not Scarfed. And that's exciting. I'm go gonna punch this guy in the face. That's what I'm gonna do. Okay, let me go for another Scald. Another one. There we go. Finally killed the stupid Sand Slash. And I actually have enough HP to live. I didn't think I would for whatever reason because I wasn't really paying attention. Oko, oh no, it's so scary. Spookadookadook. Yeah, okay, there we go. And let's see what we finish at. We finished at uh, 1263. I don't know why I couldn't, whatever. <laughs> um, so I hope you guys enjoyed. I certainly did enjoy, other than that game that uh, was really annoying with the stupid Malamar. I hate that thing. Um, so this is one last look at, actually I should probably click on, this is one last look at the team. I hope you guys enjoyed. I'll see you next time. Bye.